Magic Ritual 101 Appendix 2 Visages of Devils The earliest known depiction of Satan is in the Codex Gigas called the Devil's Bible. An illuminated Latin Vulgate from 1300s Bohemia, allegedly composed by a Benedictine monk who sold his soul to Satan. Although much less detailed, medieval art depicting Satan continued to show him as having large horns and hooked claws on his feet and hands. In this woodcut, we see him depicted with wings and a forked tail as well. Satan remains an upright walking, man-like, bodied, bearded creature with large horns and ears and a tail in this illuminated manuscript from the medieval era, depicting him making a pact with a sorcerer. Following the publication in the 1300s of the Divine Comedy of Dante Alighieri, the visage of Satan took on a very different form. This demon overlord of the lower levels of the inferno began being shown as not only one or two, but three-faced in visage. While the depictions of Satan are actually in a much greater general agreement than might be expected, other demonic sub-princes tend to vary in their appearance a great deal more.